Today, we're tackling a fascinating topic, the motherboard of a computer. I'm, your name, and in this video, we'll explore what makes up a motherboard and even discuss the intriguing possibility of making one at home. Intrigued? The motherboard is the backbone of your computer, connecting all the essential components. It's like the central nervous system, coordinating the flow of information. We have slots for the CPU, RAM, expansion cards, and connectors for peripherals like USB and audio devices. Understanding this layout is crucial before venturing into making your own. Let's dive into the world of motherboards. Now, let's talk about the components you'll need to make a motherboard at home. This is an ambitious project and requires expertise in electronics. You'll need a printed circuit board, PCB, a microcontroller for the CPU, RAM modules, input slash output ports, and various connectors. Additionally, you'll need soldering skills and a steady hand. Soldering is a critical skill in this DIY endeavor. You'll be connecting the various components to the PCB. The CPU, RAM, and other chips need to be securely attached. Precision is key to ensure proper electrical connections. Once the components are soldered, you'll need to carefully assemble them, following the layout of a standard motherboard. Creating a motherboard at home comes with its challenges. The intricacies of routing electrical traces, ensuring proper power delivery, and compatibility issues can be daunting. It's essential to have a solid understanding of electronics and circuitry. This project is not for the faint of heart, but the learning experience can be incredibly rewarding. In conclusion, making a motherboard at home is a complex undertaking that requires extensive knowledge and skills. If you're a seasoned electronics enthusiast, it might be a fascinating challenge. If you're just getting started, there are plenty of other DIY projects to explore. If you found this video informative, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more tech insights, and hit that notification bell. Until next time, happy tinkering and stay curious.